dude. You slapped a fish. You punched it. Why would you hit it? I want to make some seafood. have tons of fun activities and here are some coming up soon. Last Thursday our amazing football team went to Las Vegas and our varsity volleyball team defeated Citrus Hill. Ashley Wright had 10 kills and 14 digs. You go Ashley! And then our JV team and our freshmen got defeated. And our tennis and volleyball team battled for the best against Citrus Hill. And our next home volleyball game is Friday September 21st. Freshman and JV at 3 and varsity at 4.30. So be there, RV Square. Then on Friday, our varsity volleyball team went against Lakeside High School and our girls tennis team fought for our honor against Vista Del Lago while our cross country team raced like champions at our first meet of the season at Estancia High School. Some other news, homecoming tickets will be going on sale October 1st. So guys, grab your ladies and make her yours at homecoming October 12th. Homecoming tickets are available at the bookkeeper and are $7 general admissions, $4 for students, and if you got an ASB card, it's free. Another fun thing, Class of 2013 apparel will be on sale right about now. That is also at the bookkeeper. Whoa, so much fun stuff going on here at Rancho. Our last bit of news, food drives. Food drives start at the middle of October, so have any extra canned foods laying around? Sick of mom trying to make you eat canned greens or canned vegetables? Take them to the food drive. Giving is good. And that's all the news. We're RBTV, bringing you the news. Good morning, Rancho Verde High School. This is Mr. Wong, your principal. I uh, want to say uh, we are now in week five. Well done to everyone who has transitioned very well into Rancho Verde High School for this 2012-2013 school year. You should know by now our API score is 786. We have the highest uh, test scores for high school, again in the Val Verde Unified School District and throughout Moreno Valley. We only need 14 points now to get to our school goal, our school benchmark, 800. So keep working very hard. We want to make that a reality for this next year. Sophomores and juniors, do not forget the PSAT is on October 17. You need to go to the bookkeeper to uh, buy your ticket. It's only $14. Critical test for those students who are looking to go to some of the elite schools throughout America. Um, so make sure you take care of that. Uh, mainly seniors, but juniors also. The SAT is on October 6th. That is a Saturday. Make sure you sign up for that test. Students, we have 3,300 um, students on this campus. Please make sure you pick up trash at all times. Use those trash cans that are around you. Please dress appropriately for school. Um, we want you to wear school appropriate attire, females and males, and uh, you need to come to school every day. Mr. Quayle will share a little bit more with you about that a little bit later on. Thank you to everyone for a very, very successful back to school night. We have now seen three or four years in a row unprecedented numbers. We. Uh, gave away uh, hundreds and hundreds of uh, free hot dogs and uh, it was great to see the students, the parents and the staff members make a back to school night a very positive event. So thank you everyone and thank you all the students who provided the entertainment uh, for the event as well. Congratulations to the ROTC program, to the band, the choir and to the Bible club uh, for a very well chore choreographed and dignified 9-11 ceremony on Tuesday morning. It is a very important part of our school culture that we take time to properly remember the victims of what occurred that terrible day. And thank you to everyone who was there to share that moment. Also, thank you to R2C and to the band program you performed at our board um, hearing that night on 9-11 uh, in front of our brand new superintendent, Mr. Lopez. Uh, we're really proud of you for what you did and the performance that you gave. Again, very dignified, very appropriate for the event. Well done. On Thursday, September 20, Rancho Verde High School uh, we'll be hosting another very special presentation ceremony in the theater for one of our students. Demaria Stringfellow has been selected to the 2013 Under Armour All-American High School football game in Orlando, Orlando, Florida, which will occur in January. 
At the presentation, DeMario will be presented with an honorary Under Armour game jersey in front of his family, Rancho Verde High School football athletes, coaches, band, cheer, district officials, school board members, dignitaries, and the media. Congra congratulations, DeMario. We're very proud of you. We'll look forward to uh, watching your successes throughout this year. And as you go into college, we're very, very proud of you. Sports update. Football. You had a great victory at Great Oak High School last Friday. And uh, you're on your way now to Vegas for a critical game against Vegas High School. We wish you good luck. Uh, keep working very hard. We know you're uh, rebuilding and we're very proud of you. Girls tennis. Great competitive spirit out there. You've been working very hard. We're very proud of you. Keep going. Girls volleyball. We've really enjoyed your first opening game. You uh, really are shining. Keep, keep up the good work. Cross country. Hang in there. Stay cool and, um, and make sure you drink plenty of water. You're doing a great job as well. All the four sports programs have become very strong. Check out our website, ladies and gentlemen, www.valverde.edu slash rvhsweb. Miss Ryan and her team do a beautiful job on that website. Make sure that you look at it and uh, take full advantage of all the information. Thank you, everyone. Have a wonderful week. Go Mustangs. Hello, my name is Marcus Bell with RVTV, and today we're here with the student store. So what is the student store? The student store is where we sell school supplies, um, club t-shirts, and we sell food and drinks. So who runs the student store? Miss Witten and the students run the student store. Um, would you be able to tell us a few items, you know, that um, the prices of your items, I should say? Well, we sell cookies, muffins, chips, and sour worms, and drinks, and usually the prices run through 50 cents through $1.50. And when does the student store open? Please stop! The student store is open at both lunches and after school. Did you just smack me for telling Okay, so thank you guys, and the student store, as you can see, and bye. Not too packed this hour. The 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 best. Best. <laughs> yeah. Good morning, Rancho. This is Mr. Quillo. Um, I'm just going to talk a little bit about attendance. You guys are doing a really good job. Keep it up. Um, currently, we're at about 96, 97% um, attendance rate, so we're doing really good. Our goal is 97, folks, so um, get it up there. Also, uh, perfect attendance awards. Uh, I'd like to announce, or not for Dennis, I'm sorry, but the uh, August Math Superstar Awards. They are uh, for Miss Barkley's class, Christian Datu and Alejandro Guillen. Miss Casillas' class is uh, John Austria. Mr. Dejanef is Sabrina Ca Cavier and um, Ephraim Mendoza. Miss Duell, uh, Angelina Diana Santian and uh, Valerie Nicole Alca. Uh, Alcaraz, Mr. Ferris class, Kayla Hopkins, and Martin Medrano Rosas. Miss Hill's class, um, Edith Espinoza and Lauren Marquez. Miss Johnson's class, Jocelyn uh, Barrowman and Ivan Baragan. Miss Nohili's class, Marcus Young and Nicholas Valen. Miss Reem's class, David Esperanza, or Esparza, excuse me, and Natalie Arvisu Roos. Miss Sanders class um, is Jacob Garcia and Stacy Martin. And uh, Miss Mosqueda, who is subbing for Miss Vasquez, is Nicole Guzman and Joseph Marrero. Uh, congratulations, folks. Good job as uh, math superstars for the month. Thanks. Um, the rest of you guys, keep it up. Um, again, have a great day and a great week. Thanks. What is love?